What's up YouTube, this is Prince with ATP 101 and in this video I'm going to show you guys another 10 awesome tweaks. So make sure to subscribe and like this video and comment down below. Let me know which one is your favorite. So the first one I want to show you guys is called custom load text, custom loading text. This is a Cydia tweak and it basically gives you the option to write any text in Cydia when it's loaded. Hold up, that's not Cydia, that's settings. But open Cydia right here and watch when the load screen come up. You see that? I have two apples right there for the load screen. So let's let's do that again. Let's hit refresh. Just like that. So that's what custom loading text does. It does give you those options right there. If I go to settings, where is it at? I could go right here. I could enable it and it says custom loading text right here. I just go right there and I could put whatever I want right there. I could put the laughing emoji. Let's go back. A laughing emoji. Then you want to hit return. Then you want to respring. Once the respring is done, and you go back to Cydia, and you want to go hit refresh, you can see it changes. So that's what that tweak does, guys. It's called custom loading text. And my other tweak is called Bazi. It's, it's in the description. So this is what it does. You can see the loading bar, the battery bar is right on the notch. And you see I'm at, if you look over here, the battery percentage at 69 and it's in a circle. So whenever it's full, then this load bar will go all the way around the notch. So that's what Bazi does. So you could go into settings, go to Bazi, and this is it right here. You see I have it in a circle. And I also have the notch, but I could also do a bar. If I don't want to do the notch, I could do a bar right along the bottom. So let's go to bar, enable bar, I have it a bar, and then I'm going to go to percent plus battery. So I could have both right up here. The Wi-Fi signal will be gone, but I'll have both. I have it on bold and also have colored. So yeah, so what? Uh, let's see, respring. And you, this always pops up, you just tap on that. And now you see the difference. So now you see I have the percentage and I have the battery. And now you see the bar, it's just a bar. It doesn't take up the whole notch. So you could switch it to percent or you could just have the battery. Just like that. So you have the battery with the percent, with the percentage right in there. So that one is called Bazi. This is how I'm gonna set it up. I'm gonna use the notch and I'm gonna use the percentage. In fact, let's do the circle. And the cool thing is, after I hit respring, if you go to the, hold on, I'll show you what I'm talking about. If you close out and slide over, all the batteries in the, the little search tab, suggestion area, the widget, have that look. So if it's in the circle, then the battery widget will have them in a circle. If it's just a percentage, it'll just have the percentage. So yeah that one is called Bazi and the other one is called active display active display is this right here if I close my phone and I open it up you can see right there this is what it does but it's kind of buggy so let's respring real quick so let me respring okay you see the time was off so now you see it's correct so this one is called active display so basically it'll give you like a always on display kind of look you close it you open it back up there it is and you tap on it you just open just like that and it works great and whenever it's closed and it's charging you can see it turns to purple when it's charging so move it away it goes back to green when it's charging change to purple and this is the amount of notification I have right here so that one is called active display and you could go to settings and set that one up as well there it is you could enable it you could show the PM and AM and you could also uppercase and lowercase so that's all it is for active display and then my other one is called now playing disable if you're like me who hates the whenever you're playing a music and the whole widget is right up here whatever you're playing if you hate that then this tweak is for you so, so if I go to Spotify play a song 
and the song is playing but now you don't see that whole um, the whole widget right here so that one is real cool I hate I hate that widget so yeah that one is called now playing disable and then the other one basically another music one it goes with that one it's called Pika panel Pika panel is basically this if I go to my just like that so the song is playing right there so the song is playing so whatever song is playing and you go to your reachability this is what you get right here so you get your widget not your widget but your control center and you got your brightness you got your volume you could stop it you could skip it and the song like the background takes on the color of the, the art so you could skip it and it would just take on the whole uh, the whole so yeah that one is called Pika panel and everything works right here so it just just like that and if you bought peekaboo the tweet that right up there in the corner then you should get it for free so yeah so peekaboo and Pika panel goes together if you bought peekaboo then you get this one for free and my other tweak is called no insta story if you want to get rid of the insta story this tweak is definitely for you I don't want to expose anybody but let's go right here so basically I don't have any um any insta story if you look up top there's no stories usually there's the stories right up top but I'm at, I'm at the top of mine and there's no stories so yeah if you want to get rid of the stories on your Instagram just download no insta stories and then the other one is called silent record silent record let's turn all the way down silent record is basically a screen recording tweak so if I go to screen recording where is it at see I get the countdown so basically the screen is being recorded right now but you don't get that red bar that shows up in the top I mean so it just a clean look and when you're done you could just tap right there screen record save and if I go to my settings my camera roll I have it right here it's kind of it, it doesn't look like a video but it's a video as you can see because I wasn't really doing anything on the screen I was just talking and then you could do it like that so if you just want to get a clean record on your screen then you want to download silent record and then the other one is called still clock still clock is basically it just your clock doesn't move your stock iOS clock it doesn't move just like that and that purple light that's just face ID I get a comment about that on every one of my videos. What's that purple light? What tweak is that? It's just face ID. You could only see it through the camera. You can't see that with your naked eye. So yeah, that tweak is called still clock. And my other one is called hide updates. So if I go to my updates, let's update the cash app. Let's update that out. So basically when it's done updating, I won't see that little dot at the bottom it's just gonna look normal so if you wanna get rid of that that's how you do it see that it's finished updating there's no dot at the bottom so if you wanna get that just hide updates that tweak will get rid of that for you and the other one is called sleepy time sleepy time is for your alarms so basically if you look right here I have my alarm set to 5 a.m. and it shows me how much hours before 5 a.m. so I have 11 hours and 41 minutes before that alarm goes off the one at 6 has 12 hours and 40 um, one minutes before it goes off. So you could also set it up for the ones that don't have, that's not enabled right now. I mean, so if I go over here, we we'll go right here, sleepy time. It says enabled, show seconds, and show on disabled alarm. So if I go back, now you can see for all the ones that even disabled so yeah that one is called sleepy time and then my last one this one is the 11th one this is just a a bonus one because you guys seen another tweak like this one this one is called auto face ID unlock Excel 
auto face id unlock xl basically it lets your phone unlock without you swiping up your iphone 10 this one is just for the iphone 10 just like that see i didn't swipe up and it just opens just like that so that one is called auto face id unlock so those are 11 tweet guides it's prince with atp 101 that last one was just a bonus rate comment subscribe peace thanks for watching